Hello everybody, welcome to the channel and welcome back to Hollow Knight. So we are down here in the ancient basin, this is where we uh, finished off last time, we beat a really tough boss. And it's time to go for, uh, you know, a little bit more exploring, I'm not really sure where we're supposed to go next. <clears throat> Although, the one thing I would like to do right off the bat is I would like to go upgrade our nail, or I don't, I don't know if I can upgrade it, but I would like to see if we can. We found some pale ore in this, like, weird area that I think was the deep nest, but with that... We should hopefully be able to upgrade it, and if not, we need to. We at least need to know how much it costs, right? Like we need to know how much payload we need to upgrade this thing. And that last boss fight was hard as heck, so it is time to uh, upgrade our weapon if we can. So let's uh, let's go on about that journey, shall we? It's gonna be hard as heck just remembering how to get back up. How do you get out of here? Man, I really need to get this pass. I don't know where this pass is, but there's another one of these over in the uh, Forgotten Crossroads, too. I would sure like to have that pass. Okay, I'm sure we'll get it eventually. Okay, now we can do this, which is going to make this part a lot easier. Let me tell you what. Okay, maybe not. Whew! Wait, how do I get that one in there? What? How do you, how do you get in there? Hmm. Shenanigans. I mean, I want to go down there, but I'm scared. Dude, not cool. Definitely not cool. Yes, yes. Somehow we made that. Ugh, worth it. Totally worth it. We got them all, we got them all. Okay, so now we're back in the City of Tears. We want to go over to where that bench and that uh, station is, I think. Yeah, we want to go to the other area in City of Tears so we can go down and talk to the Nailsmith. That's what we want to do. This, These freaking guys really stink, man. I still have not figured out a good way to attack these guys. They, they sort of block everything. I mean, aside from being able to just fire off the projectile, which, you know, you can kind of do sometimes, but, like, he just, ah, oh, come on, get over him! Are you kidding me, dude? Are you kidding me? Are you actually kidding me? I mean, I'm guessing that just the one pale ore we have is probably not enough to upgrade the nail, but, I mean, we have to know how much we're even, you know, gunning for, so it makes a lot of sense to revisit this guy at this point and see what's going on, you know what I mean? Okay, we are here, Nailsmith. Okay, how much is it going to cost? I mean, one's probably not going to be enough, right? Realistically, we can't expect one to be enough. Ah, uh, mm. Oh, you've returned. Ah, I see you have some pale ore. A rare, fine metal, that. 
Give me the ore and some geo for my efforts, and I'll reforge your nail to make it stronger. Oh, I do. It, it, it just takes one? Well, I mean, plus to 800 geo, but. Dude, yes. Yes. Juncha. As you wish. I'll get to work then. Oh, I'm so glad we came back. That's going to be huge. I wish we'd have done that before the last boss. Dang it. There we go. The reforging is complete. I've added a channel to your nail. It should cut much more efficiently. You'll find it stronger than it used to be. Head out there and test its blade against your foes. Okay. How much for the next one? Hmm, hmm, you're still here. Is there something else you want? If you bring me two pieces of pale ore, I can forge it into... Okay, okay. So we got you. We got you. Next one is two. So we need to find two. Okay. Dude, that's going to be huge, though. Like, that's... I, I am I'm very happy. I, I am very happy right now. Okay. Okay, so now the question becomes, where do we go, though? Like, where do we want to explore, right? Because I feel like... I mean, I feel like we've been to a lot of places. But obviously not all of the places, right? So... I don't know. Okay, so just looking around at where we want to go next. We definitely have some options. There's some stuff in the Crystal Peak up there. Looks like we can still go check out up at the top. I think we went everywhere in the resting grounds. Went through all that City of Tears area. Right? Okay, Deep Nest. We still haven't been all the way down in Deep Nest. There's got to be something between City of Tears and Ancient Basin, right? I don't know what... There's got to be something right there. Not sure what. Fungal Wastes, it looks like we have... Okay, it looks like we have an area we can go there. So we got some stuff we can explore in Fungal Waste, but Green Path. Green Path looks like it has a lot of uh, unexplored stuff. Like, we have that one area that we can dash through now. So let's go check that out. Let's go check out Green Path. All right, let's take a look. Let's take a look. So I think we just want to go straight down and we want to dash over and see what's over there. We can also head up and to the right, it looks like. We've got another area over there to the right. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we got a couple areas we can check out. Fog Canyon. Fog Canyon. We haven't been down there yet. We definitely got to check that out. Let's go. We are in the right spot. Oh, remember these guys? <laughs> Man, it's been so long since we've been in Green Path, you guys. It has been so long. Everything's so bright and lush. Take all your money. Thank you very much. Right? Let's go! Ooh, that's tough. That's actually really challenging. Um. Oh, dude, that is brutal trying to get through that. Okay. Oh, we almost had it. We almost had it, dude. Let's go. No, dude, no. It's so frustrating. And even with the movement abilities that make this possible, it is still very difficult. It's very difficult. <sighs> oh. No, dude, come on. Okay, thank goodness it didn't put me all the way back there. Are you out of your mind? What? This just never ends, man. I can't stay up high enough, man. I can't stay up high enough. It's just so unforgiving. Oh. <sighs> 
Alright, this is the part I don't like, man. It's impossible, dude. Oh, we made it. Oh, come on, man. How is it not over, dude? How is it not over? How much further is this stupid cavern, dude? Oh, yes. I think we made it. I think we made it. And this is just the walk back, right? Okay, let's not worry about that right now. Oh, there better be something awesome on the other side of this. I'm just saying, there better be something awesome. Come on, what is it? No, dude, not more platforming. Why is it not over? No, dude. Oh, oh. What is this? Rancid egg. This would better not have all been for a rancid egg. Okay, I see, I see. Wait, what is this? Oh, rest, thank goodness. Oh. Okay, um... What is this place? What is this? This was so hard to get to. Who's this guy? Who's this guy? A visitor! Why have you crept in here, little grub? Perhaps, like me, you have a taste for discovering new things? I am Shio, and in a previous life, I was a nail master. Yes, the only thing that drove me was becoming stronger and honing my skills with a nail. I imagined it was my one calling in life, but that feeling faded over time. Now I seek a new calling, something that speaks to my soul and compels me forward. That's why I spend my time here, secluded, trying to master the art of creation. Painting, sculpting... These things bring a different kind of pleasure. Hmm, you don't seem very moved by what I've said. Was it Shio the Nail Master you were looking for? Did you come to learn a nail art? I'll teach you if you insist. Uh, yeah, let's learn your art, your nail art, whatever that is. I definitely want to learn it. Came all this way, man. It was so horrible. Whoa, what's he doing? What's he, what's he doing? Okay. Great slash. Concentrate the energy into the nail. Release the button without holding up or down. Oh, we have a charge attack now. Go Aname, Chudo. So, my work. Does it move you? The wielding of a nail, the wielding of a brush, these things are not so different. We cut into the world so that we can peer deeper inside. For now, though, I have nothing more to teach you. Your path forwards, only you can see it. Good luck. Ooh. Can I charge it while I'm... Yes, I can charge it while I'm doing stuff. Okay, that's... That's pretty awesome. That's pretty awesome. I mean, it, was it worth going through what we went through? I'm not entirely certain. This area was nasty. I mean, just unbelievably nasty. But, you know, that ability is going to be very handy. Plus, it looks cool. Can we unlock a shortcut so that we can just go this way every time from now on? That would be great. This was much better. Wait, can we? Can we? I wonder if we can. Oh, it's so close. We can... Oh, put me up here, though. Interesting. Is that a way we can cheese that in the future? If we're down there and we jump and we get that high on the spike and hit it, will it put us up here? Okay, that's good to know, because I don't want to go through that ever again, and we probably have to visit this guy again for other abilities, so that's good to know. But I think we might be able to go through some stuff now? Let's see, let's find out. Okay, no, we're still blocked off from wherever this area is. Oh, wait, I see, I see you going through here now. Right, yeah. Ugh. Woo! Woo! Wait for it. Go. Yes. Yes. What is it? Thorns of Agony. That's such a dramatic name, dude. Thorns of Agony. 
When taking damage, sprout thorny vines that damage nearby foes. That's pretty cool. Okay, one of the best things about this being on YouTube is you all don't have to watch me do all this travel. My gosh, I mean, the only thing about playing one of these games, these Metroidvania-style games, as great as they are, you do so much backtracking. I mean, you just back and forth, back and forth across the map. It can be uh, exasperating, for sure. I think it's time to go uh, see what's up with Fog Canyon. Ugh. Somehow saved that. Oh, yeah, I haven't been up here either. Never been up here. What's up here? Oh, oh, he's giant bush. It's a very giant bush. What? Okay, can you not live on top of me? That would be great. Dude. Wow, he was aggressive. He was very aggressive. We somehow survived. Dude. That was, that was nutty. It was definitely nutty. We are very low health and it is quite frightening. Um, oh, thank goodness. Okay. Oh, didn't see him. We were lucky to save that. All right, we will take all of this money, that's for sure. Okay, okay. What the heck, dude? It just keeps going. It just keeps going over here. Why is there so much more green path down here? Okay, okay. I see, I see. What if, what if I don't want to do that? What if I just want to do this instead? I thought I saw this up here. Take all this money. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Pleasure doing business with you. Okay. Ooh, there, wait, there's a grub. Yeah, I learned what they're called. They're called grubs. <laughs> all right, nice. Boy, having that dash move makes this part pretty easy. I'm guessing you were supposed to just hop over it, but you know, you don't have to do that now. Hey, there's a shortcut that leads me back down there somehow. What's that? That looks like a piece of something. That's a piece of something up there. How do we get up there? That's gonna be the real question. How do we get up there? Oh man, this is gonna be tough. This is actually, this one's, this part's gonna be tough. Oh, oh. It's just so hard to stay on top of those guys. Like it's, it, I, it's genuinely difficult. Yes, yes, what is this? Oh, okay, it's a piece of that. Oh, we got a whole thing, whatever that is. What does that do for us? Soulful. What did that do? Did that, does that give us more total soul? That's awesome, if that's the case. It's freaking awesome. Let's go ahead and chop that down, but let's also still go this way. I was wondering what those things did for us. Though once our lands, a pale being lays claim to the caverns ahead. It may appear benevolent, but it does not share our dream. Be wary to wander that place. Well, I, I can't get up there because there's a thing blocking my way. That appears to be impenetrable. I mean, I feel like now that we've defeated the giant bush, we can do anything, you know what I mean? Okay. Alright, we're heading down into Fog Canyon now. I kind of feel like maybe before we do that, we should go back up and visit, uh... Yeah, maybe we should go back up to Dirtmouth real quick, you know? It just seems like it might be a good idea. I don't know. Let's go... Let's get into Fog Canyon first. See if we can find the fast travel in here. Then we'll go... Then we'll go back. Fog Canyon. Ooh. Spooky, spooky. Okay, let's go. Whoa, what are those things? 
Look at those. Can I hit those? Okay. I can still hit them. That's good to know. What? 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 What just shot at me? I didn't even see it, man. Oh, I hear the map guy. Dang it. I didn't know what was below me, man. I can't see. <laughs> Dude, I, what is that? What? What is that? Well, that's absolutely brutal. Now we have to go all the way back down. Just going to reiterate again, that the biggest weakness of this game is the bench placement. The fact that while you're exploring, which the game should want to encourage, right? A good Metroidvania style game should want to encourage exploration. The problem is with a game like this, it really punishes you for exploring. Like if you get, you know, deep into an area and you don't have a bench nearby or anything, and then you die a unfortunate death, you have to go so far back to the last bench that you saved, and then you spend, you know, 20 minutes, a half hour, however long it is, getting yourself back to where you were. It's, it's quite frustrating. Of all the things that I hope they fix in the sequel, that's number one on my list. I want, you know, exploration to be easier. I don't know what it is that's firing at me right there, but I really don't like it. Okay, that's right, we found out we couldn't get through here. That's right, we were like, rejected by whatever this thing is. Oh, that's so annoying. It's, uh, my, my level of irritation is, is very high right now. It's very, very high. So we're gonna get some of it. Okay, I see what's happening now. I see what's happening now. Once you get rid of the big squid, that's when the thing shoots at you. Okay, now we know. Now we know. And we got our soul back, so that's really nice. We're happy about that. Dude, it's really hard to avoid. You're almost better off not killing those things if you can avoid it. Because that thing comes at you like a homing missile. The little guys aren't a big deal, but... That is insane how hard that is to dodge. Uh, yeah, you're definitely better off avoiding those guys if you can, I think. Okay, so we can go left. Boy, it's uh, quite the descent here. All right, let's see what's over to the left here. Cool. Ugh. Are you kidding me, dude? Wow. Yeah, that's what you gotta do right there. Yeah, okay, this one, you gotta do this. Oh. Over. Okay, we made it. We made it. Oof. That was tough. Whoa. Dude, Fog Canyon is crazy. What is this? Man, not having the map is the worst thing ever. Huh? Huh? What's in here? What's in here? Overgrown mound? Overgrown mound? Okay. It's kind of a weirdly large area. In that little doorway, you know what I mean? Nothing else down here? What are these platforms for? Hmm, interesting. Okay.
What? I mean, okay. Is this all we're talking about here? Just a couple of these guys? Too bad. Okay, overgrown mound is interesting so far. Get the shortcut open. Very nice. Uh, what's that? What's that? What are we doing? What are we doing? Howling Wraiths? Tap A while holding up to unleash the Wraiths. What the heck? Whoa. Okay. What's this thing? What's this thing? Hear me. I mean, I'm trying to hear you, but... Looks like that's all that's over here. Yes. Here, so well, I think we can keep going this way. No, another one of these stupid barriers, man. What are these things? These stupid barriers impeding my progress. Woo! Woo! -hoo -hoo -hoo. Didn't see this up here. We didn't go up here. That's right, those guys give you extra health. I forgot about that. Oh, don't mind if I do. Hallowness Seal. We know a guy who likes to collect those. So now we'll keep moving down. So that was the other option, right? Is to keep moving down in here. Dude, those guys are like so hard to avoid. It's crazy. Okay. Let's travel down that way. Dude, it's so eerie down here. No, I thought I could go through that part of him. Uh, where is this fast travel station I was promised? Oh, down there, down here. Whoa, what's through that way? Okay, let's unlock this first. Queen Station? Wait, we've, we've already unlocked Queen Station, haven't we? Oh, interesting. It's another... I had no idea. Ooh, what do you have there? Why, that's the key to my storeroom. I thought I'd lost it for good. Hmm, did you find it in those old mines, perhaps? Very curious. I've no idea how it ended up in such a remote place. Very honest of you to return it to me. Yes, very kind. And now that I can open up my storeroom, I can sell you some of the rare stock that's been gathering dust in there. These items may be a little time-worn, but they'll still retain their full market value. Very precious stuff. Take a look. Oh, I'm glad we found that uh, key. I was wondering what that... I mean, I, we found that a long time ago. The shop keeps key when we were up in the Crystal Peak, so glad that came in handy. Fancy key floating in the waterways of the city. I've not cleaned it. <laughs> Alright, so we've got a simple key, and then we've got this elegant key. I don't know what these go to, but I feel like I need them, so... 
Let's buy the elegant one, right? Let's buy the elegant one. It's not as expensive as the simple one, but... Seems like we're gonna need it somewhere. Alright, so the elegant key. What would the elegant key open? Probably not one of the, um... Probably not one of the those little fast travel terminals we've been wondering about. It's probably not one of those. Uh, what does this guy want? Eh? Another wielding a weapon. I suppose you'll be leaving many a corpse in your wake. If you won't spare thought for the dead, at least consider all the extra work you force upon those in my profession. Looks like I can hit him with the... I'm gonna save before I do it, but it looks like I can hit him with the dream nail. I don't know what that's gonna do, so let's just... Let's just hedge our bets there. Okay, didn't really do me much of anything, but okay. Okay, back into Fog Canyon. So what's through here? We've got to find some sort of ability that lets us pass through that black nonsense, whatever that is. Who's this guy? Oh, Bakura Pinedo. Oh, Mirabelle, the banker. Hello there, dearie. I was about to close up shop and run till you came along. I provide a banking service if you're interested. Losing one's geo is a terrible thing, and it's so much more likely if you carry it about on yourself. My vault is much more secure. In all my time as a banker, I've never lost a single geo. Maybe you consider opening an account? Um, I mean, how useful is this, really? I mean, I understand, like, it'd be, like, why would... I guess what I'm trying to think is, why is it more convenient to come back here to get your Geo than it is to go back to wherever it is you died? You know what I mean? Let's go ahead and open up the account anyway, but, uh, just to do it. That's you. You're Geo. a smart one. Next time some dreadful beastie gets the best of you, you'll be glad to know your Geo's safe within my shell, or er, vault. Now, let's do some banking. It's so crazy. Okay, that's cool. Um, I don't think there's much more I can do in Fog Canyon, believe it or not. I think we've been everywhere that we can go, because we've been blocked off so aggressively from the, uh, from progressing with whatever it is that black nonsense is. Let me try something. Th this might be a total waste of time, but we have that fancy key, and I remember we had a really fancy door in the Soul Sanctum that we couldn't open. And I feel like... That might be for that door. Let's go check it out. Yeah, right? An ornate door made from glistening metal. Insert elegant key! Yes! Yes, insert the elegant key. What's in here? Is it a boss? Is it a cool ability? Oh man, what is it? It's ominous. It's definitely gonna look like a giant arena! Ugh. Ooh. Yes. guy's booty so far. Yes! Dude, we dominated that guy. No problem. Oof. Oof. He didn't look like he was going to be too scary, but we definitely dominated him. Okay. Uh, what, what do we get for our reward? Something awesome, I hope. Anything up here? No. Okay. Uh, a figure connected to a device. Examine closely. I mean, yeah. Oh my gosh. Was not ready for that. Shade Soul. Tap A to unleash a more powerful spirit. This spell consumes some. Okay. Oh, it's more powerful now. It made my little shot attack more powerful. That's cool. 
I wonder if there's any chance that also breaks through those stupid barriers for me. Is that a thing that's possible? And that would be amazing if that's the case. All right. No? for sure that was going to be it. Dang it. Okay, well, it is what it is. Oh, right, I couldn't go up here before. Huh. Now we're in some new stuff. Okay. Smaller version of those jerks. That's terrifying and horrible. Nobody likes that at all. They're not too bad, though. They're not too bad. I can see it getting hairy if there's like three of them. Top seems like a good idea, right? I think so. Wow, dude. Okay, no idea where we're going here. Okay. Crazy. Okay, where are we going, man? Where are we going? We just keep going up. It's so dangerous. It's so dangerous. Paid off, though. Paid off. That seemed cheap, but okay. Dude, you have such a small... Such a small window right there. All right, let's move forward and see. Oh, that's where you're supposed to go. Okay. All right, we made it. We made it. Oh. Hollow nest. Hollow nest's crown. Hollow nest's crown. Wow. Does that mean we're at the very top? Is there going to be a horrible boss up here, man? Wow, what is this? Pale ore? Dude, that is awesome. What happens if I do this? What it took me back down through here? Yes, dude, that's awesome. Alright, we found some pale ore. Let's go. Okay, heading down here. There's got to be something else down in City of Tears, right? What about this? Mechanism to use the simple key. Nice. Finally, we found some place we can go. Man, this we have been lost for a really long time. 
Where is this? Royal Waterways? What are we like in the sewer? Are you kidding me? Whoa, dude. Okay, those guys are kind of tough. They're kind of tough. Okay, we remember those jerks. Oh, yeah, it's totally like them in the sewers. Bench this way, you say. Okay. That might be good. We've been searching for a long time. I am extremely tired as we've been trying to figure out our way through here. Okay, let's go do this, huh? Ooh, and there's a bench right here. Okay, it's kind of a messed up bench, but it is a bench. Wow, all right. Okay, everybody, I think that's gonna do it for this chapter of Hollow Knight. We, uh, we spent most of this chapter exploring, trying to figure out where we were going. We found some pale ore, we upgraded our nail. We didn't really find a whole lot of new areas until the very end. It took us that long to figure out how to get down here to the Royal Waterways, but we're here and we're ready to explore. If you enjoyed the video and had a great time watching me wander around lost like a tourist, please leave me a thumbs up and then subscribe to the channel so that you don't miss future videos. And we'll see you for the next chapter of Hollow Knight. Oh, I'm so tired of being lost, man. I'm so tired of being lost.